coaching style, how do you think it gets the most out of your players? Well, I think anything's relationship based. And if you coach them hard, you got to love them hard. And uh, they got to believe that you care, you know, and you got to have a passion for what you do. And I think anybody that does a job and does a job as long as we do a job, you know, there's 24 hours a day. We're kind of like the Waffle House. We don't close. And uh, whether it's recruiting or coaching or dealing with kids or, you know, problems, whether it be good or bad, you know, in situations that they got to know that you care about them and then you can coach them hard. And that means holding them accountable. And accountability is something that's very tough for any generation, but especially generations that come when it's been a microwave society, when you just drive through and basically order it on Amazon or, you know, it just shows up or tweet this or Google this. You don't have to search for the answer. And football is a tough game. Life's a tough game. So when things get tough, you know, you look to figure out a way, hey, what's the shortest way I can get this done instead of sometimes the best way I can get it done? And the best way is sometimes the hardest way. And uh, that's what these kids got to understand. It's, it's tough and it's hard and that the reward is big and it's worth it. Talk about your strengths and what you kind of bring to the team with this style of coachable run. I mean, well, this fit me perfect. Like, I wouldn't want to be nowhere else but here in this scheme. Uh, with the RPO things, um, I just can't wait. How what? have the other QBs been doing? So. Uh, we all been battling. I mean, it's, it's all fun and games. I mean, we come to work every day. We uh, joke around with little Evan. We play around with him. It's good to have him up here with us. Oh, oh, yeah, he's smart. He's smart. One of the smartest kids I've been around. He's always trying to work. I mean, nothing wrong with that. We, uh, I come up here with him and throw sometimes, but he's a very good kid, very smart. Good for you. What, what was day two like? How, was it still chaotic out there? Yeah, it is. It's, um, it's fun, though. Like, it's, it's all new to everybody, but we're all having a lot of fun out there, enjoying it. With the new, It's a new culture out there with these coaches, and everybody's really enjoying it. Was the fun kind of out last year and the losses and everything. Yeah, well, last year's last year, man. Like, uh, we're just trying to move forward and just focus on this year and just forget about last year.